All right, Julie, thanks. Health insurance is one of those things that you may not think about a lot until you really need it. And then it is the only thing that you care about. If you are searching for a policy to cover your family's changing needs or if your job situation isn't as stable as it used to be, our next guest can offer some help. Lawrence Allison is the CEO of MyInsuranceExpert.com. His company's website provides one-stop shopping for insurance based on the factors that you choose as the most important. Good morning to you, Lauren. Good morning. Let me just also say we're going to uh, link your website to ours, myfoxdc.com, because it's going to be a lot of information we go through and want people to get uh, the, the headlines on what they should do. Excellent. Uh, first, let me just say that your company no ties to any insurance provider nor either candidate. With that, let me ask you, you've done the research on these candidates. Mm -hmm. What are the headlines coming out of each camp here? Um, how do they differ? The main thing, though, no universal health care, right? Right, exactly. I think that's one of the big things that the candidates just aren't talking about, mm -hmm. is the mere fact that they're talking about health insurance reform. They're not talking about health care reform. So we're not talking about a difference between going to see the doctor you love mm -hmm. and not going and seeing somebody else. Talking about paying for it. Exactly. Yeah. You know, how do you do that? And what about the 47 million Americans that can't get insurance right now? And that's really the key. Both of the candidates are trying to get insurance for those people. In one camp, they're saying, okay, we're going to provide a national system, which is really just another insurance provider mm -hmm. for those people. And the other one, they're going to say, okay, we'll give you a tax break to go and buy your own insurance. Obviously, it's great for our company, you know, a little transparent here. Hey, we love to have people buying individual health insurance. But all, all said, it's important to get people with health insurance, and I mean true insurance. That's what both men are looking at. They, uh, the devil's in the details, though. Go to your site for that. You have, a, you have the breakdown there. We do, okay. and uh, you just go to myinsuranceexpert.com. Okay. Let's talk about um, some of the five ways, clear-cut five ways to find the best deal if you are looking at uh, health insurance. The first one, you say, health discount cards are not insurance. Right. You've got to be really careful. I mean, right now, people go out and they buy insurance, and they think it's insurance, yeah. and it's really not. All it is is a discount card, and that truly is exactly what it is. You're going to go to get a prescription, it'll be discounted. You're going to go to the doctor, it'll be discounted. That's not insurance. You buy insurance because if you have a catastrophic event, let's say you need surgery, it's fifty, hundred thousand mm dollars -hmm. That's what you buy insurance for. So if you can afford a $5,000 deductible, go buy it. Get it because that's what's going to protect you. Second tip, shop around, compare coverage and prices. It's really important. What's the candidates are talking about this. Oh, it's $12,000 to cover for family. Well, in the individual health insurance world, it's not. It can be a $1,200 a month policy in group, but when you go with individual, it's $400 a month. Mm -hmm. So you really got to go out there and talk to an insurance company that actually can compare all the plans that are out there and get you the best deal that's possible. Meet your budget and your needs. Also, know what's covered. Oh, yeah, the details. It's a really important. Most people really don't know the moving parts of health insurance. Mm -hmm. So you've got to talk to somebody who's licensed and who understands all those moving parts and then can listen to you and talk to you about what your needs are. You say get creative. That's interesting. What does that mean? Well, you know what? Sometimes people really don't think about what they need. So I hear a lot of people say, oh, I want dental insurance. Well, for what? Uh, I go get my teeth cleaned twice a year. Well, do you really need dental insurance for that mm -hmm. for $70 or $150 a year? Probably not. But if you're going to go and have some surgery, then you probably want that. So when you look at your health plan, you've got to know what's important to you. So for example, like health savings accounts are a great way for family to save money, get triple tax advantage, mm -hmm. but people aren't looking at that as an option right now. We promised you five. We're out of time, but tell me what buzzwords mean. What, how, what do we look out for there? Well, you want to make sure you understand copay, coinsurance. Yes. You want to make sure you understand <laughs> deductible. You want to understand what premium is. And if you can get all of those parts and you can talk to somebody who actually can walk you through those pieces, then you can actually understand what you're purchasing. All right. Lawrence Allison, thank you so much. It is myinsuranceexpert.com. Again, you can go to our website. We made it easy for you, myfoxdc.com, for a link to, uh, to Lawrence's website. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Steve, back to you.